Good morning, YouTube friends. It is 7.30 in the morning, and I am going to New York City. So let's go! Currently in the airport, in a very long line. I waited in the wrong line by accident, so now we're in this line. Okay, I've officially landed in New Jersey. Now I somehow have to figure out how I'm going to get to New York City. So I'll be going to Times Square, but I don't know how to get there. I don't know if I'm gonna do like a train or an Uber. We'll, we'll see. Update, I'm doing Uber. I'm going with Daniel. Hopefully Daniel gets me where I'm going safely. I know I should have taken the train, but honestly, my luck, I'd get on the wrong train. So this is what we have to do. Daniel, I'm Brent. Sweet. So how long have you been driving for Uber? Oh, long time. <laughs> long time? Over four years. Four? Okay, hotel room reveal. Ooh, this is pretty nice. <laughs> Look at that view. Oh, we have some of the city right over there. Beautiful. This is honestly pretty nice for New York. There I am. What's up? Hi, Brent Television or Brent TV, whatever you call me. This is nice. This is gorgeous. Gorgeous throne. Only $900 a night. Just kidding. Look at this. <laughs> you can't be the only one that, you know, when you get to a hotel, you just love looking around. It's like, this is my temporary home for three days. Why is the toilet a rectangle? Why do they gotta do that? See, this one is for if you take a pee, and then if you take a poo, you gotta use the big one, because it's gotta use it all, all of its might. Got two waters, one for me and one for the special guest that you haven't even seen yet. He's still on his way. Got coffee, we got these beds. Pretty nice, I'm happy with this. So the special guest I'm waiting on, he's still 45 minutes away. Uh, his way of coming here was a bus. I flew because I was not in the mood to sit in a seven hour bus ride uh, because I got here literally in an hour and 10 minutes because I came from Pittsburgh. So I'm gonna go ahead and like kill some time because I still have like an hour until he gets here. Cool little pub right now. Okay, so now I'm officially on my way back to the hotel because the special guest that I'm meeting with has just landed, even though they took the bus. So we're gonna head back to the hotel, and this is our first time ever meeting each other. We've known each other, but we've never actually met each other one-on-one, -on -one, so this will be exciting. So take your guesses now on who you think it is. If you said goodbye to me tonight, ooh. Very clean window. So I don't know if I said this, but as soon as I got to the room, I realized you need to put a key in to get to our floor. So I'm gonna go ahead and meet him outside. Castaways. <laughs> well, as I was saying on my way down, I'm going to greet him outside. Aw, oh, you. Shit, you're real. What's up, dude? Nice to meet you, man. My heart is pounding right now. <laughs> this guy. I'm like, I'm gonna go greet him outside. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, so the special guest is uh, Mr. Mr. Horchata. Oh god, he's wearing the merch. Yeah, the merch. <laughs> so this is a uh, room reveal. We're not showing the number though. Ooh. Nice and oh, that's nice. Look at that. I know. Look at, Look at that. Nice. So, I know. Two waters, okay. I know, two waters. That will get us through three days. Yeah. That's that's just for survival right oh, there. Man. So I guess. Oh my god. Okay, good night. I brought stickers. I only brought stickers. Whoa. That was smooth. <laughs> okay, we just finished filming our first ever TikTok together. So, yeah, but be on the lookout for uh, our first TikTok together. Aww. Our first Aww. TikTok. First TikTok. <laughs> so Jorge and I are gonna be going live, uh, doing a bop-off. A bop-off, yeah. Bop-off together. Uh, and this was, we actually kind of became friends with the inventor of Bop It. His name's Dan, Dan Klitzner. Uh, and they're sending, he's sending one of his guys here in New York to, uh, Award the winner with a custom Hor Bapa, which is a bop it created, inspired by the horchata. He's practicing over there, and I, I gotta, I gotta practice. Shut up, bop it! Shut up, bop it! 
Hi, Dan. Hello. <laughs> Hello. So it's, 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 it's very official. We have security in the room right now uh, in case we start to kill each other. It's official. We're alive doing the bop off. Uh, so as I said earlier, we're going live head to head doing a, a bop it challenge to see who's best at the bop it. And whoever wins, wins a whore bop, huh? And I'm going to win. This dude will not. I'm going to win. No, you're not. Uh, I would like I would like you to know that you're not going to win the Orbapa. I had a long one hour flight and I practiced pop it and annoyed the whole flight. I had a five minute. Wait, you speak so highly of him, but you make fun of my hat. Uh, I broke in the room. She broke into my hotel room. I'm actually here for a professional convention, right? What's the name of the convention? Huh? The, the anti sponge convention. You know the anti sponge. Yeah. Listen, everyone say hi to YouTube, but listen, to be fair, I went first under pressure. Everyone makes mistakes in life. You, you are, there is no shame in making a mistake about it, but you did a great, a 33 is perfectly respectable for a sponge. Wow. That sucks. Wow. That sucks. Wow. So you're, te wait, you're telling me that I, I won the Horbapa? That's tough. That's tough. Print television has fair and square. I don't know about fair and square. Fair and square. square. Fair and square. Was there any cheating involved? Not cheating. Oh, is this exciting? Is this exciting? I don't know. You get the one that fell on the floor. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Nice. The guy that invented Bop It gave me this shirt. It says, the guy that invented Bop It gave me this shirt. That's iconic. Thanks, Dan the Bop It man. Even though you didn't really give me this. It's from security. Oh my God. Is this gonna be a big reveal? The big reveal of the whore Bop Up. <laughs> yes! Yes, look at the whore Bop Guys, the packaging. I thought. Oh my God, this is gonna look great on my desk. I love it. I love it so that hurts, much. That hurts. This is amazing. I'll eventually Look at get this. it. I'll, it'll eventually and it's signed. Back. It's I get another autograph from Dan the Boppet Man. I'll eventually. It'll. Wow. So that was Dan the Boppet Man. We finished yes, our sir. competition, and he's they're paying for our meal. Yeah. Wherever we want to go, they said send us send us the receipt, uh, and they're paying for us. Nice. Very cool guy, Dan the Boppet Man. Check out his socials. I'll mm -hmm. link them down below. Now let's go yes, get sir. food. I'm starving. Let's get food. Oh my god. Do they have Spongebob popsicles? Well, they're turning. Great. So we're eating at a place called the Meatball Shop. Right, so let's see how this is. So we've made it in, we got a candle. Uh, this is the best date I could ever ask for. Yeah. <laughs> I got the chicken parm like as an entree. What'd you get, the chicken parm parm snack? Yeah, it was a sandwich. What is that? Meatball burger. <laughs> So now we're headed to David Buster's. David Buster's. Maybe we'll win out. We'll win Jorge a prize. But if you guys are enjoying this vlog so far, please give it a thumbs up. I hope you are. I'm also gonna link Jorge's channel down below. Go show him some love. We're trying to get him to 10K. Let's do it. We can do it. Come on. Come on, everyone. Yeah. I'll I'll give away some merch. You see, I mean, I don't know how many people. Look at this. I'll give away stickers. Get him to 10K on YouTube. There we go. We can do it. It's kind of funny. Whee! Okay, we're at the Holy Grail Dave and Buster's. Let's see what this is all about. You ready to go in, Mr. Horchata? Yeah, let's see what you're about. Okay. Are you good? Yeah. This is the game to play right here. Pop the lock. This is my go to. So. There we go. Nice. Okay. It is packed. It is like, guys, this is insane.
here than they are. Oh my god, it's missing pegs. No. Oh, maybe. No. Basically, yeah. it's like a middle school locker. You press that button every time that red cursor is over. My record's 21 in a row on it. I don't want you to be on that one. Oh my god! All right. What was that? So many people, Jorge. There's so many people. I can't process this many people right now. We're talking like six months ago. We were told to be away, stay away from everyone. Now, like, on the ice cream truck. So as I was saying, Mr. Horchata has never been to Krispy Kreme, so we're at Krispy Kreme. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. We're in. We've done it. We've made it in. Here, take a hat. Here you go, sir. Take a hat? Yes. We're so dumb. Dude, that's one sweaty Krispy Kreme, man. Okay, everybody. Well, that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed meeting uh, Jorge. If some of you don't know who he is, uh, basically we had a, a huge tick <laughs> a huge TikTok war going on between the two of us, and today was the day we officially met. Uh, so lots of fun. We did super ironic. We did a lot today. Uh, so if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Jorge's channel will be linked down below. Let's get him to 10k on YouTube. Dude, if we have 10k, I'll give away merch, like how I said. If you're new to the channel and you liked what you saw, feel free to subscribe. It is 100% free to subscribe. What are you waiting for? Mm -hmm. And for merch and other fun stuff like this SpongeBob Popsicle sticker that's labeled as Funny Viral Sticker, www.brenttelevision.com. Follow my Instagram for no reason. I post stupid pictures on there. Who doesn't love a stupid, funny picture? Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all tomorrow. Stay tuned because we've got even more people that will be joining us. See you then. Bye.